indecision and capacity building they don't align if you are suffering from indecision it might be challenging for you to make some concrete and very important decisions my name is coach wilfred asukwa i am a capacity builder i'm also a certified john maxwell coach i'm also an it certification trainer public speaker as well as the founder of the virtual coaching platform Zit worldwide on this channel we discuss things that will help you to have common sense i call it common sense with freddie so if you're just joining us for the very first time please don't forget to smash on the red subscribe button below this video and i can tell you for a fact it's going to help us to better better impact you positively so today i'm going to be throwing a little insight about indecision and that's why because a lot of my clients they suffer from what i call indecisions why are they suffering from indecisions why because they are talking to too many people who are not adding value to them there is a research out there that says that um when you speak i mean you have an interaction with the person that is negative you will need three positive interaction to counter or dissolve that one negative interaction and the more negative interaction that you are having with people the less you will make positive decisions so when it comes to capacity building a lot of people keep asking me why do I have to do this? Which one should I go into? Which IT certification should I get into? The IT certification or the IT training space is broad, is wide. So where are you going to start from? The reason why you need to talk to people that will help you up to speed. You want to talk to people that are well more exposed and experienced than you. Remember, the choices you make is always going to be the function of the awareness that you have. So when you keep talking to people that are going to be sharing negative vibes that are not going to help you make informed decisions, of course, you're going to be suffering from indecision. And from indecision, it leads you to procrastination. And those are not things you want to deal with. So as a coach today, I want to encourage you to make a positive positive impact on your life by keeping healthy relationships with people who can better help you grow, better help you understand or gain understanding about life generally. Until you make this kind of decision, then indecision will continually impact you. If you're struggling with your finances, you need to talk to people that are having a hang of their finances. If you're struggling with your finances and you're talking to people who barely can survive, you can't be talking to people who do not understand more than what you are looking for because how are they going to impact you? It's going to leave you with confusion and with a disturbed mind. So going forward to conquer indecision, I encourage you to build a network of people around you who will help you grow who will impact you positively from your interaction with them you want to have positive interaction not negative interaction as ever this is your boy coach wilfred asuko sharing with you common sense with freddie see you all at the top because the bottom is crowded mm -hmm.